Okay, this video is going to be about a few things. It's going to be about emo haters, how to be happy, and happy, advice. Happy, joy, joy, happy, happy, joy, joy. Yeah, Justin, shut up. Please. Shut up. Uh, Justin, don't do this. I need to make this. Uh, it's it's going to be for... Uh, whatever. I'm not going to yell at him in the video. First, it's going to be about emo haters. Seriously, there's no point about em um yell coming to people's streams and stuff, saying stuff about hating them and faggots and stuff. All those names, it's not right. Yeah, it isn't right. Never yeah. do that. Yeah, my brother's even doing that. And he's a fat little pest who's a grade higher than me, so my little brother. Because I say back twice, but yeah, it's not point of yelling at people. It's like people do it. I think because to make themselves feel better. I don't really know. But people do weird things this time of the year in all the world. So that's first part about the emo Hayden. Don't do it. Second part is how to be happy. Well, happy is relax. Don't be all jumpy out of thing. Um, and you have to like calm, take breaths, listen to music, sleep, whatever makes you relax. Me, I listen to music, write poetry, and stuff like that. Some people cut. Um, that's not healthy. They do it for two things. Ninety percent of people who cut do it for attention, even if they don't don't want to say it. The other part is mental disorders. They just most of the time when people break up with someone and they cut themselves, they want the person to notice them. It's not healthy. Um. Be happy about things. Like, you have friends. If they tell you that you're a really nice person, take that for granted. Um, if you aren't taking that for granted, and you're like, you're just saying that to make you feel better, no, don't do that. Cause they are trying to make you feel better, and you're just setting them down. I know that personally, cause I used to do that all the time. It's not good. Your friends try helping you. They're your friends. Don't be rude to them. And your friends last longer than any relationship would. Like me and my friend Corey. He's been friends with me for six years now, since sixth grade, and I say back uh, once in high school because I switched schools and I didn't have enough credits. I kind of graduated with, well, I didn't graduate, uh, I kind of went to um, my school I'm in now, Dean, with 10 credits. That's not good. Um, but yeah, you. he's been friends with me for so long, he doesn't care that um, anything. He's a good friend. He tell he tries to make me feel good and everything to, uh, because of my breaks up and everything. I don't date that much. I've been through, uh, six girlfriends in my life. That's all. There's no point dating very much in my life right now. It's just too much drama for me. But yeah. And the last thing. Advice. For people who think killing yourself over a person is worth it, don't. If you're, pr if you ask a person out and they deny you don't kill yourself they don't cut yourself and all this stuff to, it's not worth it. it that just creeps them out and stuff like that it's not healthy also I said that before relax don't be all out of it see I am really good at giving advice normally people come talk to me a lot and I do that and and I try helping people sometimes but sometimes I can't help people because of like I have problems of my own too. I'm not gonna stop my life to help someone else. I just can't do that every day. But to get a girl or a guy, be yourself. Don't lie, change yourself. I was lying about my life for a while and then like I became comfortable with myself. Look, I am skinny, so what? I'm skinny, I wear girl pants. No point, there's no point of it. I wear a pink belt. Okay, there's no point of it. Um, when it comes to changing yourself for someone, I became emo scene, cause I like the style. The hair is awesome. People are nice, and they're different. No, not much people nowadays walk around the street with my style, and I like that because I don't want to be like people. It's pointless. And when you're trying to get a boyfriend or girlfriend, normally they'll notice something different. So if you're different. Then they'll notice you, normally, but sometimes, like, uh, not to be, uh, 
like labeling or anything, but preppy girls and stuff like that, they normally don't like emo kids because that's just how I noticed it. Not to be labeling or something like that or anything. That's just how I notice things. And it's weird. Um, you have to like relax. Don't lie. I mean, come on. Little white lies are no big deal. They're nothing. Little white lies are small, don't hurt anything. But if you lie about, uh, let's see. I'm in cosmetology. I'm seriously I'm in cosmetology. But if you want to make yourself seem out of, um, hi, uh, they would lie about what they do. Like, if I was 24 and I'm only 16 right now, but if I was 24 and I was a cosmetologist and I wanted to make a girl like me normally and they didn't like the cosmetology guy thing, then I would say, uh, I'm an underwater marine welder, something like that, because uh, I used to be in a uh, metal fabrication last year in Chicopee Comprehensive High School uh, in Massachusetts, but now I'm in Holyoke uh, Dean Tech, Massachusetts, so yeah, um, I don't want to lie, make myself seem, hi, yeah, not right now, I'm making the video thingy, okay, that was my mom. She asked me about uh, want more onion rings because she makes homemade onion rings. Oh my god, yummy! But yeah, I broke up my girlfriend, my latest girlfriend Lizzie broke up me. But it's a big, perfect good explanation. See, advice is for this. The biggest thing is breaking up with a girl. No big deal for you guys or some lesbian girls out there, bisexual girls. No big deal. I was sad for a day. Yeah, but that's just because I am. I got over it. It was only for a week that we dated, so I'm no big deal. She has some accessories or anything. All I got is jelly bracelets, which I made to a really cool thing. I did that, and yeah. And she has, like, my gloves or anything. No big deal. It's things that cost, like, $12 or something. They're, I don't have very much money, but that's not very big. Like, I she get my keychains and stuff, but she's nice. Don't get me wrong, she's the sweetest person ever, but we were just couldn't do it. She lived in West Wakefield, the next town over, and I lived in Holyoke, and I don't drive yet. So yeah, relax, be yourself. Biggest thing ever. Have a nice day, and comment, subscribe, and rate. Thumbs up, guys. What? Oh, uh, girls. What do you What do you mean? Remember Lizzie X's? Yeah, guys. Don't use girls for sex and stuff. It's not worth it. Mom, do you have any advice for um guys out there? Treat your women good. I just said that. Kind of. <laughs> Mostly. Never use your women. Justin, because I said, Justin, shut up. and disrespectful, and that basically means if you hit them or anything, you're gay. Put that way. Um, don't listen to him. He's not help. I'm going to take a quick shower. Thanks for telling YouTube that. <laughs> this minute's 500 seconds long. I don't know how long that is. How much is five seconds? Six seconds times. That's for an eight minute video. Woo! That's the longest video I ever made. I deleted the other one though. Oh, it's still recording. I should uh, end this now. Have a nice day. Subscribe, rate, and thing. Bye, and if you want to make and no, uh, if you guys want to make a response to this thing, like a video thing, if you have a camera, make it fun. Have a nice day. Comment, rate, subscribe, all that stuff. And listen to uh, the new Escape the Fates thing. And if you want, go see the new uh, uh, Nightmare Before Christmas 3D movie coming out soon in theaters. Oh my god, I want to see that Tell so bad. Tell your friends about 